All right, mathletes. So it's time for the comment war downstairs. All right, some of you guys even arguing with me. What the heck you arguing with me about? <laughs> it's like you come and teach this class. So let's go ahead and let's figure out how do we do this problem? And I'm always amazed of, I learn new math every day from the comments. So that's a cool part. So put down what you think the answer is and let's see if we get the same answer. All right, so check this out. Word of the day. It's not a word, it's an acronym. PIMDOS, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally, right? Our order of operations. You gotta make sure you got the order of operations down when you're doing math because so many times this is where people get wrong, right? And so you're gonna see in the comments over time, come back and, and watch this video so you can look at the comments, all the different out answers out there. So check this out. According to our order of operations, you gotta do parentheses first. Luckily for us, there are no parentheses. All right. Second thing we look for, exponents. You see any exponents? No, we don't got exponents going on. All right, next, multiplication or division. Whatever one you see first from left to right, you do first. So here from left to right, we see the division first. So we're gonna go ahead and divide these sevens all right, that's our first step. Everything else, you're gonna drop it like it's hot, right? You're not doing anything with the rest. So seven divided by seven is one. Everything else, I'm gonna copy it the way I see it, all right? So there's our first step. So now I see, I ask myself, do I have any more um, multiplication or division signs? Yeah, we still got a multiplication sign right here. So now we gotta multiply that before we do anything else. So let's go ahead and handle business. Boom, plus 49. And then so these two right here gave me that 49 and then that minus seven. So now you could handle your addition and subtraction, right? Because there's no more, there's no parentheses, no exponents, no multiplication, nor division. Now we add and subtract from left to right. And again, if you do this right, it won't matter because addition and um, subtraction, right? Addition is commutative, so I could rearrange our numbers here. But here we're just going to go in order. So 7 plus 1 is 8. Bring down that 49 minus 7. And now we're going to do uh, 8 times 8 plus 49. So that's going to give us 57 minus 7. So our grand finale here, folks. Let's see if your answer is right. 50. And that's how you do it. All right, mathletes, hopefully you got the right answer. Ask your questions down below and we'll see you mathletes in our next video. Peace.